channel. So I am shooting from my beautiful island of St. Vincent and the Grenadines. And so today I want to walk you through a series of things that I found and by things I mean clothing items. As you know, on this channel, I aim to be as sustainable as I possibly can, which means that I often go thrifting or I wear my clothes on repeat and I have my clothes for years. I don't get rid of them. So I often shop and find pieces that I know that I'll wear for a very long time. So you will find in my closet there are items from 20 years ago, believe it or not. So that's my way of being sustainable. And in this series, I'll be walking you through what I did in order to find some of the most gorgeous pieces. You would not believe it, guys. But I went under my mother, my sister, my aunt, my friends, just kidding just my sister and my mother. I went under their beds. Oh yeah, you heard me right. I went under their beds. It's under here. Oh my God, I already see a print I love. And I found these gorgeous pieces, guys. You would not believe the fabrics, the quality. They're just great. So I'll be sharing them with you. So join me for this series, guys. You're gonna have a blast. I can guarantee you're going to see some pieces that you like. And I hope you get inspired to go revisit the pieces that you have thrown away, whether it's in a bag or in a, in a closet or in the attic or the basement or in a suitcase, something that you have forgotten, go and find it, go! Rediscover it and style it up nicely and fall in love with it again. That's the aim and the goal of this video and of my channel. I want you to fall in love again with old pieces. That doesn't mean you don't have to go shopping, I'm not saying that, but we want to reduce our consumption as much as we possibly can. So, let's reuse, let's buy the right fabric, and remember on this channel, my current mantra is fabric, fit, and style, meaning you look for natural fibers made from plants and animal fibers guys look for those in order for you to be more sustainable or eco-friendly or environmentally conscious so with that said guys i hope you enjoyed this series and i'll see you in the next one so i found this gorgeous gorgeous skirt and as you guys know this style is in I don't know how this got there. I don't know whose it was. Maybe it was, I believe it was one of my sisters because that's definitely not an old piece of mine. And I doubt very much it was my mom's, but I found it and I love it. I also found that top. Oh my God, guys, this skirt, it's amazing. I love the cut. I love the style. I love the way it fits it would pair so beautifully for the fall and i am so mad that i didn't bring it with me i left it back home but i plan on going back home to look after my mom so i'll probably get it again but really love it it's a hundred percent cotton the top is polyester it feels that way it moves that way and i'm pairing it with my gladiator sandal this is treasure number two, numero uno. Duh. 
guys you have seen it before remember when i shared in my zara haul comparing the stuff from my closet with those that i bought from zara yes this is it it looks different doesn't it but yeah i got it in my country under my mom's bed <laughs> i can't get over it it's an absolutely gorgeous piece it feels great it feels like silk but i'm telling you right now this is polyester in disguise it doesn't have a label on it but i know we could not afford silk so i believe this piece was made by a local centrist whether it's in trinidad or in saint vincent because we often buy our own fabrics and make our own clothes so yeah i believe it is absolutely one of those items i love it ah, we're getting to the juiciest stuff guys treasure number three i was so excited when i spotted this print under my mom's bed oh my god oh my god and guess what fun fact in 2016 when i visited my mom i found the top and i wasn't paying much attention to it i just wore it casually around the house i went back last year and i found the skirt under my mom's bed <laughs> i could not believe it guys and yes i'm smiling i am happy i found this beautiful piece and it is a really really sustainable fabric it is viscose i think but let me double check on this because i could be wrong actually it is a cotton and polyester blend guys i couldn't leave it behind yeah i brought it it is with me and i'm gonna be wearing this for the fall here i'm rocking it during the summer really really love it ah my god it is such a great two-piece set the brand i think is memories or memoirs it's a bit faded but oh my oh my oh my i really do love it and as you guys have seen on so many online websites right now this is the style that is happening this is what's going on and initially i thought the print was a hibiscus but it's a rooster if you look carefully you could see it <laughs> i couldn't get over it when i discovered that but it is a rooster and here you could see the versatility of it i'm wearing the top with the levi's jeans that i got from my son's haul and on my way back inside i saw this water tea pitcher that my ex gave it to me and it has the same color scheme and i couldn't help but show it to you <laughs> sorry to interrupt guys but just a quick note hi guys if you just so happen to just click on my video you are new please click the red subscribe button so here they are guys if you click on these buttons you'll be part of my channel and you'll be notified when i post new videos and most importantly guys it's free thank you so much for subscribing love ya let's get back to the video so we are now at treasure number four numero uno yes guys such an unexpected find because interestingly i do have a very similar print in my wardrobe and it's a kimono piece that i pull out every single summer and i've already paired it with it and guys it's like a match made in heaven oh my god i love them this piece is a hundred percent rayon as you guys know rayon is biodegradable i just love it surprisingly i have worn this piece so much guys oh my god it's now in the wash 
It was a piece from one of my sisters who lived in Trinidad. She was so surprised when she saw it on me. <laughs> Treasure number five. Oh, such a good find. Ah. I must say that when I first saw it, I wasn't quite sure. I thought it was really, really too old to be given a second life. But boy, was I wrong. It's such a gorgeous print. And I absolutely love the color. It's such a nice spring color. I love this color on me. It's this pale pastel turquoise spring color and uh, it fits beautifully it hides a multitude of sins i love the style i love the fit and i love the fabric guys it's a hundred percent cotton ah uh, look at the neckline it has a gorgeous square neckline that ah uh, it's so flattering i was so happy to find this piece it's really gorgeous it's so trending right now and that you know i don't care whether it was trending or not i saw it i love it and i fell for it it took some time to get out the creases because it was under the bed for so long it was almost unrecognizable as a really good treasure but it's now with me in Canada and I'll be wearing it for the fall as well treasure number six ah treasure number six guys is delicious when I first found it I wasn't quite sure I was going to be able to fit in it because you know with the Caribbean breeze and the Caribbean food your girl had put on some little extra 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 but i took the chance and it has become a great treasure very versatile as you see here i've paired it for work and i've paired it casually as well it is such a gorgeous piece absolutely love it it has this gorgeous detail that is very common on pieces at zara H&M, Mango, and other stories, Topshop, but this is different in the sense that the style is asymmetrical, whereas most of the other pieces are just usual, you know, the boring stuff, but this is giving you life. Ah, oh, love this piece. <laughs> Treasure number seven. Now, you see what I'm talking about? If you have been watching my videos, guys, guys, I'm showing this back to you. You have not been watching my videos. You have to. This is the common piece, a popular piece. The way the style is often made on all the stores right now. I've shown you this piece. But yes, I found it at home under my mom's bed. It's another piece that I didn't think would fit because yeah the little snuggy huggy yeah you know but now it's fitting so quite well because I've lost the pants but yeah it's a definite treasure this piece guys you have seen this piece I threw it in because I want to show you the details you can't miss the details of this piece and again this other treasure guys treasure number nine yeah, I got it under my mom's bed. If you go watch my H&M unconscious videos, you'll get a better sense of why it's a treasure. So remember to always love yourself and to accept your perfect imperfections because they are what make you unique and drop them gorgeous. Love you. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.